Hello, friends. Oh, I'm sorry, I have been a stranger lately. I have just been crazy. It's been so busy. Everything is just uh, blowing up. Christmas time is just a busy crafting time. I did a craft show and uh, have another craft show coming up. Had a bunch of orders. Uh, did a lot of great things and learned a lot of great things. So today, uh, people have been asking me about making bows. Uh, bows are hard. Uh, and the, uh, one bows of the, are hard. And one of the easiest, uh, there's an easy way of doing bows that I'm going to show you um, that I learned so I can show you how I make a bow. And I am not good at bows. It's hard for me, but I found one that I like uh, and that works. So I'm going to show you two ways of doing the same bow. Um, first way, I just use my hands in a ruler. So uh, you just get any regular ruler and if you can see, I hope, um, but this is also a ruler, so each square is one inch, because uh, it's hard to see that. So what I do is I start with the tail. The tail is going to be six inches, five to six inches, so it's two, four, six inches, and I pinch it. So um, it's going to go around, so I want to turn it up. So this is the biggest thing with this bow uh, is that you got to keep twisting it but I have a two and a half inch wired ribbon and so and I'm going to make a little loop. Now for the loop again I'm going to pinch it at the bottom. You can see right here and then when I get this part I'm going to twist it so you can see the front. So I'm going to make this three inches. So right here, I'm going to fold it at three inches and bring it back under and pinch it. And this is the hardest part is holding it here. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to do it with a clip next time. So again, twist it front. If you have ribbon, that doesn't matter, which there isn't much of that. Uh, and I do it again, three inches. Pinch it. Twist it. So again, three inches, one, two, three. Pinch it. Twist it. And it doesn't matter which way you twist it, just as long as you twist it up. So I pretty much know this is three inches. So I'm gonna go just a little bit past it. Pinch it. Twist it. Go again, one, two, three, pinch it, twist it, and you do one more, I do three at three inches, pinch it, slide under here, and twist it. Now you've got three on this side and three on this side with your little loop in the middle. You have one tail. So you're going to cut the other tail at six inches. Two, three, four, five, six inches. And you will straighten that up later. So what I do, oops, I've got to tell you, be prepared. The most important thing here is a pipe cleaner. I don't know what they actually call these. Tinsel stems or a pipe cleaner. So I cut them in half to stretch them. I really like this color that's uh, hard to tell a color. So you take the pipe cleaner, put it in there, middle, bring it down, and twist it. Twisty, twisty. Keep these things because you're going to use it to put on to whatever that you clip it on to. Pinch it. Try to get this as tight as you can into here and leave this part. So now you have a tail here and you can bring your tail out here. So now you got tails and your bow 
Now three, I take one, I go, and you'll do the opposite thing on the opposite side. So the top one and the middle one, I go this way and maybe pull this one out. And then I'll turn it around and uh, I'll go down and up and pull this in. And look at that, a beautiful bow. Now I don't cut these ends until I put it on the piece and I get the length I need. And then I either make a V this way, this way, whatever, or I pinch it and make my little. This way, if you need a longer stem, I like to pinch it and do the little cut in the middle. The other way, other thing I do is when I'm done, I use uh, to singe my edges. This keeps it from raveling without having to put any chemicals on it. So just a little touch here, just sets it and it won't ravel on you. Cute, a real easy way of doing that. So I'm gonna show you a second way. Uh, I'll make a little bigger one out of this one. I have this ready. So I'm gonna go six inches. So I have my number here and I'm gonna pinch it. I'm gonna make my loop. Uh, so I'm going this way and I'll make the loop to go the other way. So a lot of these things you just have to get used to doing, right? So, and twist it. So I'm gonna start at three inches. I'm gonna make a bigger bow. Oops, and what I really wanted to show you, if this hurts your hand, if you have trouble withholding it, you can use a clip, uh, a clothes pin, it'll help you if you're having trouble getting it done use this kind of a clip or this kind of a clip whatever works for you um, you can pinch it pinch it better and then you can keep working it's a lot it's a little easier because it it does get kind of hard on your hands if you do this a lot so i'm going to go three inches this way pinch it in the middle right and twist it really doesn't matter which way you twist it. So now I'm going to go four inches. So I've got one at three. I'm going to do three at four to make a bigger bow. Twist it. And I'll do four inches. Pinch it. And twist. Pinch and twist. Pinch and twist. See my messy table there, sorry four inches, pinch it, and twist, four inches, pinch it, and twist, four inches, I think this is our fourth one, our third, fourth, four inch one, yeah, we got three, one more, four, Pinch it and twist and do six inches. Cut it off. Your handy dandy clip here. So making sure I got three, four here, and I've got three, four here. Why am I ended up on the same? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. These should end up opposite directions. There you go. So, use your pipe cleaner. Try to get them about even. My little things. And Twist. Twist it tight. Now bring your tails out here. Now you have your little uh, thing in the middle. So I'm going to take the short one and go up. This one and go down. Do this. Stop. <laughs> I don't want them to see me. <laughs> You had to see that hat. 
They're teasing me about my hat. I like my hat. I do kind of do the opposite on this side. Fan out your things however you think it makes it look pretty. Fluff it up and do your thing. How cute is that? Oh my goodness, I love it. How cute is that? Bow, instant bow. It's really not that hard. Uh, again, you cut it where you're ready. Uh, let me get my, I have a piece, of, I have a making fork. Uh, I made It's a Wonderful Life round here, and I'm going to put this up here. Isn't that cute? And see, I'll cut, I'll cut it to, to fit, and I'll have some winter uh, Christmas little sprigs here and here. Maybe some red berries in it. Ooh, that'd be pretty. Isn't that cute? Cute, 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 cute. Thank you. Have a good evening.